last I can have some proper food. <laughs> Hi. Get down. <laughs> A microwave. Bit high tech for the castle. It only just about copes with light bulbs. Now how am I going to hot up my bacon back bonanza? Try frying it. Good thinking. Something smells a little... Barney. Who's Barney? Oh, that'd be these. <laughs> I got to your dad's farm. I loved it. The animals were so cute. I gave them more names like Jimbo, Corky and Mr Squeaker. <laughs> well, uh, here in the country, we tend to not name the animals. Then it only makes it hard when the time comes for the uh, one-way trip. Nice. Where to? Well, it's a very clean building. The tiled floors. <laughs> Oh, I'll get you. A swimming pool. No. <laughs> the big pig pen in the sky, where the troughs always full. Yeah, they do like that grub. Right. And so do we. Where do you think that bacon bat came from? This, the service station. <laughs> Newsflash, it came from a pig. I just heard of the best gossip at the shops. Apparently there's this Lady Don Raven, all the villagers think is really standoffish, never joins in with anything. Oh, people can be so snobby. Lady Don Raven, Lord, you know. Probably lives in a big house. Or a castle, even. Oh, yeah, right. Newsflash, you're Lady Don Raven. A pig? <laughs> but not like, not like your dad's. That's what you meant. Yes, finally. That's it. I'm giving up meat. From now, I'm going to be a, what you call it? A vegetarian, <laughs> as of now. Right. What? Your idea of a vegetable's ketchup. <laughs> what do you mean I'm Lady John Raven? Well, it's the title of the Lady of the Castle. The yeah. Castle. Yeah, but they couldn't have been talking about me. I'm not standoffish. Well, uh, you didn't go to the cheese rolling, or the well dressing, or the welly wanging. <laughs> yeah, but I've been really busy. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so maybe I'm just not into weird local costumes, but the next thing I promise I will go to. Where's the Bogmore Ball tonight? That's perfect. A ball? Tonight? Th there's, a, there's, a, there's a ball tonight? Oh, I am there. Great, because the lady of the castle opens the dancing. <laughs> Did I say I was there? <sighs> okay, okay, I will go to the ball. Only if it stops the women in the shops from selling me mouldy bread. <laughs> You're all coming to the ball? Awesome. You can see me do my best trick. I teleport Benji O'Leary across the stage using two cabinets. No one has ever figured out how I do it. News flash, everyone knows. What? <laughs> how? Doesn't take a genius to figure it out. <laughs> Benji O'Leary has an identical twin. Leo puts Benji in one cabinet and his brother in the other. Two twins and two cabinets. <laughs> it's so obvious. <laughs> Best trick. Ruined. It's not fair. <laughs> well, my work here is done. Pigs are really cute. <laughs> this one's a bit over the top, isn't it? Not for this one. He'd escape from anywhere. This one's trouble. Like me? Healing up, Mr Squeaker? Don't worry, you can have a long and happy life. Happy anyways. What do you mean? Let's just say he's coming to the ball tonight. Hey, a dancing pig. <laughs> Not so much as for the dancing as for the eating. What? Suckling pig roast. <laughs> well, if I'm going to be open in the dancing, then don't I need someone to dance with? Kate. Kate! Mr. McGonagall dances. Who's Mr. McGonagall? Kate! <sighs> and she's gone. Then what about me? Oh, um, hi, Gabe. I'd be honoured to be your partner, my lady. I've attended many balls. Admittedly, not for a few hundred years. <laughs> well, what's a couple of centuries between friends? You're on. <laughs> Magic is all about precision. I have to stun them tonight. I need a major illusion. That you can actually do magic. Sorry, that is a major delusion. Oh God, that's brilliant. Look, I made this disappearing trick. 
Ladies and gentlemen, I will now cause this plan to disappear. The Gonia be gone! <laughs> oh. Magic is all about precision. <laughs> Sorry, step through your toe again. Did you? I didn't even notice. You're an amazingly fast learner, Lady Dunraven. I didn't think I'd be any good, but with you it's easy. And please, call me Danny. You do me much honour. <laughs> <laughs> Yuckety yuck yuck. What are you doing here? Helping Leo find his magic cape. But clearly you two want to make googly eyes of each other. I'll leave you two lovebirds alone. What? No! Wait! No! Of course not. I and Lady Dunraven and I and I are, are simply rehearsing. <laughs> For what? Ghostio and Juliet? <laughs> the ball. I've got to open the dancing. Or I'll forever be trending in the shop, hashtag Miss Snooty. Well, you can't dance with him. What? Well, he's the only one I can dance with. The Bogner Ball happens in a marquee. Outside the castle. Think, Gabe. Oh. Oh? What oh? Ghosts are trapped in the place that they died. I can never leave the castle, nor can Esme. Really? But we were doing so well. I'm sorry. Forgive me. For what? It was fun. But that means I still need to find someone to dance with. <laughs> I'm never going to get used to that. Or the fact they can't touch the living. Okay, where is he? We need him for tonight. Now hand him over. He'd probably escape by himself. Mr. Squeak is always escaping, and maybe he had good reason. Like, he didn't feel like being roasted and eaten. Uh-huh. I didn't say which pig, did I? <laughs> He's so guilty. Got any proof? Um, uh, Trotter Prince to the front door. Listen to yourself. You know, I did hear some funny noises coming from the east wing. Did you? Yeah, like snorting. What, like? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Do it again. Hello. Are you winding me up? No. Now, excuse me, I've got to get back to veggie tasting. Mmm, that is good. <laughs> that was so much. You are right there, mate. I've got to get you somewhere safe. Come on. Ladies and gentlemen, I need a volunteer. <laughs> Thank you, young lady. Now, please, may I have your autograph? It's okay, I can do it from here. Awesome! That is well cool. Okay, watch closely. <laughs> Ta da! Now, what is under your seat? A chocolate chip muffin. A chocolate chip muffin? Okay, break it in half. What's inside? Chocolate chips. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh. It was meant to be the piece of paper with your name on it. I'll have to resort to my old standby. Taking my shirt off without removing my jacket. <laughs> it's okay, we've got three hours. <laughs> Ta da! Major wedgie. Uh, uh. I just want you can help us when the chips are down. You can always count your own flesh and blood. Sorry to mention flesh. Pig? Well, how can you lose a pig? Oh. Pig police here. We better get out of here quick, Mr. S. <laughs> oh, Mr. S. Oh no, Squeaker escape. Just keep your eyes open because Jimmy said he heard snorting. Snorting? What sort of snorting? <laughs> yeah, just like that. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Meant that. Jimmy? Phone call for you in the kitchen. Kate, make sure she gets there. Thanks. Down the corridor, on the right. Yeah, cheers. It's the squeaker. <laughs> Hello? 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 There's no one there. I can't even get reception on the landline. Hello? <laughs> oh, no, there's no Lady Dunraven here. Oh, no, wait, that's me. <laughs> oh, Mr McGonagall. Yeah, yeah, Kate said you might. <laughs> no, I haven't got a dance partner yet, so if you're free. <laughs> Brilliant, you want to come around and practice? Okay, bye. 
Okay, so Gabe can't do it, but I suppose it is better to have a dance partner who isn't, well, dead. <laughs> do you want to end up in a bap? Is that what you really want? Because that's what's going to happen. We have to hide you somewhere fast. Ta-da! I need you to hide this somewhere. <laughs> you need me to hide as a piece of string. <laughs> okay. Oh, not again! Yeah. Squeaker escape! My tricks! <laughs> box isn't big enough. <laughs> this will do. Come back here, I'm on your side. Humans are strange. Gotcha. Stop doing that. And he is strange, even for a human. <laughs> What's in there? <laughs> oh, that's my lad's pig. Oh, Kate's been looking everywhere for him. Shh. You have to help me hide him. What? No, no way. I'll get into well big trouble. You'll get into trouble. He's gonna die. Death isn't that bad once you get used to it. Well, I don't want to be haunted by a pig. Just look at his face. What do you say? Sausages. <laughs> Sorry. Now, if you don't mind, Jimmy, I'm sort of working on a trick here. Can't you just make him disappear? No. Yes. That's it. He's he's perfect. He's just what I need. Need for what? Uh, I mean, sure, I'll hide him for you, cos I'm... Such a nice guy. And so very unselfish. <laughs> Thanks, Leo. I know I could count on you, pal. What do you think you're doing? The great vanishing pig trick. It'll be my finest illusion yet. And what do you think your dad's gonna do when he sees you on stage with his missing pig? He'll be totally cool about it. <laughs> Come on, Dan, it was only a pig! <laughs> It'll kill me, won't he? Yep. <laughs> no worries. Find something else. <laughs> well, so, new lady done Raven. Thought you'd be taller. Mr. McGonagall? I'm a bit hard of hearing. Oh, um, Mr. McGonagall? Yes, that's me, Missy. No need to shout. Shocking manners. Well, I hope you'll be able to keep up. When I start dancing, I burn the house down. <laughs> Please, make yourself at home. <laughs> what will we do with your hair? What will I do with my hair? Um, <laughs> I haven't really thought about it. What? I said I haven't really thought about it. Well, I would if I were you. And about cultivating a more ladylike tone of voice. All ready. <laughs> and? What's up? Uh, you're helping very much. <laughs> Billy must register my strong disapproval. So what? That's all you can do? Oh, really? Well, I'll show you. A corkscrew twist. Are you ready? Not really. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> not really! <laughs> this is no time for lazing around. You have a lot of work to do. Unless you want to make me look silly. What's the matter? Look like you've seen a ghost. Raven, how's the ballroom boogie going? I'm just rushing up a veggie lunch. I am <laughs> When do you reckon these will be done, our face? <laughs> well, by the looks of it, the 12th of Neville. <laughs> oh, this is so muddy. They must have fallen on the ground. That's where they're from. Have you seriously never been this close to a vegetable before? Do gherkins count? <laughs> Please help me, I'm so hungry. <laughs> oh, that was such a bad mistake. 
vegetables. Give up your secrets. Kill them, chop them, boil them. It's called a soup. Soup, eh? I I've heard of that. <laughs> soup. Soup. Perfect. Don't want to overdo it. Pass me that towel. <laughs> Why have you got invisible? Because they don't want to be seen with someone decorating a pig. I'm disguising him. Who's going to recognise him now? Yeah, no one's seen a muddy pig before. I'm not finished yet. Wow. Now he's transformed. Ladies and gentlemen, I will now make a live pig disappear before your very eyes. Prepare to be amazed. Squeakus. Porcus. Be us. Wow, it actually worked. I hope you're not going to say that on the night. I mean, I thank you. And now to make him reappear. Squeakus, Porcus, return him. I'll, um, I'll try that again. Return him. The back hatch is broken open. Impossible. No pig could have done that. This is no ordinary pig. Squeakus, get you. We gotta find him. Jimmy will kill me. Not if your sister kills you first. Or your dad. <laughs> 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 I can't stop staring at that thing on his head. And when he gets back, he's teaching me the tango. Truly, ballroom dancing with the wrong partner can be a testing experience. Well, what if he does it again? And I fall in front of everyone. There is no way I can do this, even if it makes me the most popular person in Bognor. Um, Just tell him I'm busy hoovering the dungeons or something. Uh, that is perhaps not the best idea. Well, you've changed your tune. I hate to see you dance with that man, but I do not think you want the villagers taken against you. The last time they took against the Lily Dunraven, it did not end well. Well, what happened? They burnt her as a witch. <laughs> OK, fine. And maybe you should start the dance before Mr McGonagall starts on the puddings. What? Why? Well, he doesn't overdo it on the sugar, does he? <laughs> <laughs> Leo! Where's Mr. Squeaker? He's, uh... Squeaker escape. Yeah. Right, we need to find him before Caitlin does, or he'll end up as crackling. And so will we. Okay, okay. So what do we have that a pig doesn't? Eyebrows! <laughs> Our brains! Right, you search rooms, tombs and ballrooms, and I'll search halls, walls and ballrooms. Can you say that again? No! <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Squeaker! What are you doing? There's prize for the ball. How could you? You do smell good though. <sighs> Moist. Flaky pastry. No, I swore I wouldn't. At least one of us has principles. Jimmy? <laughs> hey, Lynn, hey. Oh, nice pig to... Hair, hair. Uh, how's it going? Oh, rubbish. I still can't find that pig. Oh, shame. Uh, do you want some soup? I'll bring it to you in the dining room. No, thanks. Uh, you know, I heard some snorting coming from the attic. Right. Like you heard snorting in the East Wing? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Sorry, I'm getting a cold. What was that? Uh, nothing. Uh, the attic? No. It came from that box. No! No, no it didn't. <laughs> I knew it. You do have that pig. No, 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 no. Out of my way. Okay, so I lied, but oh, when you see his eyes. What eyes? <laughs> These eyes, potato eyes. <laughs> <laughs> one, one, no, no, two. Okay. <sighs> Squeaker escape again. He's unbelievable. <laughs> Not bad, Missy. 
course, you're the great teacher. Yeah, he was fabulous. <clears throat> Danny, can I talk to you for a second? All right. I'm off to the barbers. You're kidding, right? <laughs> I advise you to spend the time left practising. Only one chance to make a first impression. Right, I will, for sure. Okay, make it quick. You know that pig? What, the one Kate's been on about, the one that went missing? Yeah, that was me. They were gonna eat him. Right, he is a pig. Yeah, but when you see his little eyes and his floppy ears. Kate's right. You won't last five minutes living off the land. Pff, I made soup with my bare hands. You need to give Piggy back. I can't, he's escaped. I need to find him before Caitlin does. What do you want me to do? Well, Kate's on to me, so I need you to distract her. I need to get ready. The whole village is expecting me. Please, Danny, I'm your cousin. We are family, aren't we? You heard Mr McGonagall. If I mess up, he'll never forget. Danny, I need you. Mr Squeak needs you. Blood is thicker than water. What does that actually mean? I have no idea, but can you please help me? <laughs> OK, I know I'm going to regret this. <laughs> Kate, um, have you got a sec? I really need your advice. Well, I'm sort of busy. Oh, it won't take a minute. <laughs> well, what? Oh, um, uh, what do you think I should wear tonight? Uh, this or this? <laughs> well, uh, I think we can rule out the slime kit <laughs> and the wetsuit. <laughs> Actually, it's tradition that Lady Dunraven wear the Bogmore bar gown. Oh, well, what's that like? I look like a giant <laughs> wedding cake! <laughs> Don't even think about it. <laughs> Danny, I really need to go and find that pig. No, no, Kate, wait! No, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I know I can count on you. <laughs> Only one chance to make a first impression. And what an impression you've made. Well, we'll forget this in a hurry. The ball is ruined. No, it's not. It just needs a tidy. A tidy? The, the place is trashed. We need a whole new venue. I know. We can have it at mine. I do own a castle. <laughs> Boy, I love saying that. <laughs> right, everyone, grab something and follow me. <laughs> no, don't, don't worry about me. I'll be two minutes. Mmm, <laughs> this is good. Aha! Cheat. I knew you couldn't go veggie. But this smells so good. Even Mr. Squeaker tried to eat one. Double aha. Okay. Where is he? It's all so confusing. I love animals. I also love the way that they taste. Life was so much easier in the city when chicken came in a bucket and didn't have a name. I did warn you. My dad loves his animals too, so he takes care of them. If it wasn't for him, they wouldn't be here. Yeah, I guess you're right. At least that pie is made with pride. Which is more than you can say for this microwavable rubbish. Yeah, fair enough. 
<laughs> but can't I keep him as a pet? Don't go all sentimental on me now. But look at his little eyes and his little black snout. <laughs> Don't try and pull that one on me. Oh, come on, he's practically family. And that's what we've been through. <laughs> he is really cute. Right, I'll speak to my dad. Yes. But you're going to have to pay for him and, like, clean out the barn for a month. Oh, yeah, no worries, no worries. Hear that, Squeaks? You're safe. <laughs> <laughs> you were great in there. That wedgie trick really brought the house down. And my pants up a little bit too far. Still, they <laughs> loved you. All they need now is Danny to start the dancing. I hope she got most of the muck off that frumpy old dress. Wow. You look amazing. Just a little something I found in the back of the wardrobe. This is our dance, Lady Dunraven. Let's get this over and done with. <laughs> I'm terribly sorry, my good man, but I believe this lady is taken. Fair enough. I bid you good night. <laughs> Shall we, Lady Dunraven? <clears throat> I mean, Danny. Yuxville, you said it. <laughs>